white to d4 black to f5 white to g3 knight to f6 bishop to g2 black to g6 knight to f3 white to d4 black to f you okay there Working it all out, once and for all, Arthur. Mm. What now? We're back, and I'm sitting here, and I am contemplating the great journey of the sun and considering a famous chess move. Those oily enactors of a mediocre justice, the Pinkertons, and their benefactor, the depressing millionaire, Leviticus Cornwall, they want us, Arthur. They want us. And they are going to have us. Well, maybe they ain't the problem. Meaning? I don't know. It's just, well, I can't help but feel we would have been better running off someplace else. <laughs> but the, the game ain't over, Arthur. I mean, I ain't, I ain't played my my final move, but... I guess I'm more interested in surviving than winning a chess. And maybe life ain't such a thing to cling on to so tightly. No doubt. But what's our move here? You sound like Hosea. I miss. Um, I asked you a question. What do you think? We can't stay here. That much is obvious. Where are we gonna run to? I mean, they chased us from the west. They chased us over the mountains. They ran us into the sea. Arthur, do you have my back? Always, Dutch. But there's more than your back to worry about. We need more money. We've been on the run for months now, and I seen you killing folk in cold blood like you always told me not to, and I'm sorry, but I can't help but think that if we just- There is country in Roanoke Ridge past Butcher Creek. I believe we could hold. Okay. You and Charles, you could take folks up that way. Micah and I need to do some reconnaissance. I ain't got a final plan yet. Arthur, I ain't got it. I just need time. I need time and no traitors. Charles, be right with me. Always. Where are we headed? Up past Butcher Creek. It's Murphy Brew Country. That's why I'm asking you to ride with me. I understand. What are we doing there? We're looking for a place to hold up. Even the law won't follow us up there too, willingly. Yeah. I did some scouting up there while your boys were away. And? Hmm. We'll see. I know the way. Follow me. We need to get this done fast. Pinkertons will have reinforced in another day or two. Yeah, the sooner we get out of here, the better. It's quite a ride up there. I saw some canoes near the bridge up river, which would take us right up to Butcher Creek. Might be quicker. What do you think? I say we just ride it. It ain't worth messing around with boats. Okay, sure. It's good. Charles. You too. Thanks for what you did in Sam Denis. Real brave drawing them off us like that. I was worried you and Abigail had both got yourselves killed. I found a spot to lie low for a while, then managed to get a ride with a wagon of workers heading out to the fields. Abigail said she somehow managed to slip away when they grabbed Hosea. You did good getting the others out of there. Keeping everyone together. 
Everybody was pretty shaken up when I got back to Shady Bell. Uh, it was a tough few days. I couldn't have done it without Sadie. So how did you find that spot back there? I assume the skulls on sticks weren't an addition of yours. Huh. Old Strauss knew about it. The locals are terrified of the place, so we figured that might buy us some time. And it did. Until one of you brought the law with you. And where did you end up again? Cuba? Oh, uh, not exactly. An island off of there, called Warma. Landed ourselves in a heap of trouble. Really? A tropical island? Isn't that just what Dutch wanted? Uh... I guess it didn't exactly live up to his ideals. Anyway, I ain't always sure Dutch knows what he wants anymore. Perhaps not, but he's always managed to figure things out in the past. I know. You're right. Just... It's been... Uh, I guess I just miss Hosea and his uh, wisdom, you know? Of course. There's the bridge. It's not much further now. So, I spent some time up this way while you were gone. I ran into Rainsfall and Eagle Flies, the Indians. And I've been trying to help out a bit where I can at the reservation. Things are bad there. Uh, that's not a surprise. They seem to be in a lot of trouble heading into more. Some men there spoke a lot about the Murphy gang that hides out in these caves. A place called Beaver Hollow. They're animals. Everyone is terrified of them. Just recently, a stagecoach from Manisburg disappeared without a trace coming through here. Great. The Dutch didn't mention this. Well, hiding up here... It's not a crazy idea. This is a spot nobody comes near. Even the law. But just be ready. It won't be pretty. You see that up ahead? Slow down, keep it quiet. It could be some of them. I say we dismount here and follow them on foot. See where they're going. Follow me, stay quiet. Let's get closer to him. Come on, up this way. Definitely Murphy's. I say we deal with them from here. You take one, I'll take the other. Because I do the skinning. Well, how about I do the skinning? Then who do Quick, the Quick, Arthur. Carrying? You're a son of a bitch, you know that? Good job. 
We must be close now. Let's stop and have a look from the top of this hill there. Let's go. Okay. Let's see what's going on. That's a stagecoach we're missing. Jesus. They must be in the cave. All right. Let's get on with this. Okay. What you think? We can head into the cave or flush them out with dynamite. Dynamite be safer. Yeah. Let's be quiet and hope they don't come out. Let's get this over with. Get that poor girl out of the cage. Don't touch me. <laughs> Just calm down. Stay away from me. Where are you from? Antisburg. What do we do with her? We take her there and I'll go get the others. Sure. Miss, you okay to ride on my horse a little? I'll keep you safe. Antisburg, right? Yes. Thief. 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 Um. It's okay, miss. The others, they, they killed them. You're safe now. Just try to breathe. They're animals. <laughs> I know. Yep. <laughs> It's all right, miss. Why would they? It's 
Some folks is just evil. Ain't no point trying to explain it. <laughs> I haven't slept in days. <laughs> I know. What's your name, miss? It's okay. <laughs> Meredith. You're gonna be home soon, Meredith. And this will all be over. Thank you. Where in Annisburg? One of the mining cottages. Um, <laughs> if you get me to the main street, I can show you from there. Okay. Just try to relax now. Yeah. Just head for the main street. It'll be easier to walk from there. Which place is yours? Up at the top of the hill. It's near the blacksmith. Mona. Ma! Ma! Meredith! Oh, she's alive! Oh, she's alive! You saw some pretty bad things, I'm afraid, man. Murphy Brew got Oh, my God. How did you manage well, to? I just ran into them and found her. Oh, thank you. Here, let me give you this. Oh, that, that's okay, ma'am. You just... Keep her warm and keep her safe. <sighs> this is down. Oh no. You leave me alone. You just leave me alone. Thanks, buddy. How you get on? Okay. Found a girl. I took her home. Oh. You and Mike could find anything? Maybe. I think maybe. I found our old friend, Mr. Cornwall. You did? Yeah. He's buying a stake in the mine in Annisburg. Relentlessly ambitious fella, isn't he? Mike and I'll sniff about, see if he knows we're here, and exactly what his plans are. So, Dutch, did you miss me? I found her drunk in Saint Denis. You're back. How jolly, Miss it's O'Shea. Funny, you Shit. Back Who and drunk. The master, the Lord Molly. God, all my calm down. I won't be ignored, Dutch Vanderlyn. I am in him. I ain't her. I ain't his stooges. Calm yourself. You don't know me, nothing. Miss. I don't know you, nothing. Nothing. Okay. I'll spit in your eye. I did. I told them. I'm sorry. Yeah, I told them. I tell them again. Now I've got God's ear. You told who what? Mr. Milton and Mr. Ross about the bank robbery. And I wanted them to kill you. You did what? I loved you, you goddamn bastard. Go on, She's shoot me. Crazy. She ain't worth it. You told on <laughs> no, me. You betrayed so now, me. What? Just calm down. Arthur? <laughs> She's a fool. Get her out of here. You know the rules. You are not so big now. Hurry, Your Majesty! You... Take her! She knew the rules, Arthur. What the hell is wrong with you? 
Mr. Pearson, Mr. Williamson, get this body out of here and get it burnt. Okay. Now get back to work, all of you! Quit your lollygagging! Right. Get back to work! Yeah.